there, this is Amy. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, tonight I'm just going to show you real quickly um, a couple pieces that I made a while back for my grandson's baby shower. And I'm not going to actually show you exactly how I did them per se because they're actually already done. But this is something cute that you can do very inexpensively with a lot of different types of pieces of glassware. Something where maybe you can put together a nice gift for the holidays very inexpensively. We have an old time pottery close to where I live and you can get glassware dirt cheap. And I don't know if you have a place like a dollar store or something like that that sells some nice different pieces like plates and cups and mugs and that kind of thing that you could do the same. Basically what I did is I bought a couple handle sticks I uh, apologize for that sound. Every time I come down into the basement to make a video, uh, somebody opens the basement door. Anyways, I went to the store, bought two candlesticks that are in the green, because the baby shower was a monster theme. And then I bought one in yellow, and bought these. These are actually regular dinner plates on here. This is more of a serving tray type thing because I wanted something bigger to place the uh, place the cake on. I don't know if you can see that very well or not. So then what I did is I turned them upside down and just on the plates I took a tip that you can put on your paint bottles that's gloss paint, my faux garden enamels, and just did a squiggly design on each one. Now I kind of with the yellow did the blue and green to kind of pull in the green from this candlestick and then with these I did blue and yellow to tie in the yellow from the other candlestick. Allowed those to dry and you really don't have to bake them because with it being this thick and this paint does cure by air drying for 21 days it's going to be fun and the purpose of of these were just to use it for the baby shower so there was really no need to, to bake it. You can if you want, but really isn't necessary. Then I took the E600 glue, glued just a little ring around the top of the candlestick, and then put these on top of the candlestick, did the same thing with the serving tray one, and put such a thing on it to give it some pressure to, to really get it to glue nicely and so that it'll be really durable. That glue is awesome, by the way comes in a tube and just really has great hold. Um, I just I've always been happy with it. It's de definitely a dependable glue you know, if you really want something to stay. These were awesome. I mean they they really were fun part because I actually set it up as a like a candy table cake cupcake kind of table. So they were really fun pieces to have and I've just put them aside in case I need them in the future. Who knows? You know, I might end up giving them away. But anyways, just uh, something to share with you. Thinking that with holidays coming up, you want to give something to somebody that's unique. Here it is. Somebody that, that actually entertains a lot. This is something cute to do. You know, do your own design. You don't have to do what I do. But just very easy, affordable, and unique to say the least. Anyways, that's it for today. Thanks for stopping by and let me know if you have any questions. I'd love to hear your feedback. Have a good day.